Hey y'all, it's Nick from Undefeated Production. Welcome back to another video. In this one, we'll be talking about the final trade that my New York Mets made in exchange. They, they, they acquire Michael Givens in exchange for um, pitcher Sal Gonzalez. Before we get started, as always, hit that like and subscribe. Comment down below who you think won this trade. Did the Mets win? Did the Cubs win? Let me know in the comment section below. So, Mike Hill Givens. Been rumored to go to the Mets a couple times. He's reuniting with his manager his rookie year, Buck Showalter. And this year has been a solid year for Givens. 2.66 ERA in uh, 40 games, 40 and two thirds innings pitched, 51 strikeouts, a 1.254 whip. His career numbers also very, very respectable. 3.34 ERA in 400 games, 437 innings pitched, 517 strikeouts, a 1.181 whip. Looking back to prior years, uh, 2020 had an absolutely atrocious season. When I guess not too bad, considering he got traded and had atrocious numbers in Colorado. In 2021, between Colorado and Cincinnati, Cincinnati much worse numbers in Colorado, but it pitched to a total of 3.35 ERA. And like I said, career mm -hmm. ERA 3.34 is very, very respectable. Now, the Mets, they needed another reliever. They get Michael Givens in the bullpen, 29.7K uh, percentage, 11% 11, uh, 11 walk percentage, and a 41.4 ground ball rate. That is a very, very good. And he's signed to a $5 million deal, a uh, one-year deal with the Cubs in March. So, Sal Gonzalez going over to the Cubs is pitched to a 2.81 ERA and 25 and two thirds innings pitched. Um, only in 14 games, one start. So, he's a reliever. He's only struck out 29 batters and he has a whip of 1.208. Uh, yeah, a whip of 1.208. So, overall, he's unranked in the Cubs organization. So, the Mets here, they move a low minor league uh, pitcher in exchange for a reliever that is going to reunite with Buck Showalter, who Buck Showalter knows is going to help push the Mets. They need another reliever, having traded Holderman. They're also getting the likes of Trevor May back and the likes of Jacob deGrom. So overall, the Mets deadline, you know, I'll, I'll take a minute here in this video, talk about the Mets deadline. They bring in Vogelbach, they bring in Naquin, they bring in Gibbons. Three guys. We were rumored J.D. Martinez, Juan Soto, Wilson Contreras, David Robinson. All these guys, and they have very underwhelming deadline to, to what we were compared to. Billy Epler doesn't go out and, you know, bust down the farm for someone that, you know, for a move that he might end up regretting in the future. You know, overall, looking at this, it's a solid, solid move. I wouldn't say, you know, or the deadline is solid. Um, I think that I like it more than a lot of other people because only because we're getting Trevor May back, another reliever, and uh, Jacob deGrom, the best pitcher in baseball. I feel like our, our additions with, oh, we have one more move. Apologies. I'm making one more Mets video. But this one will probably go out last. I forgot about Darren Ruff. Include Darren Ruff in that. But we made moves to make our team better, and that's ultimately what we needed. We needed a better team. We needed to fill holes. Now, nothing is going to be looking at it as this big thing, a big just fix. But we upgraded DH, arguably our biggest need. Catcher's still a glaring hole. We are getting James McCann, too, back uh, in uh, Thursday. On Thursday, I believe he's coming back. So I don't know if that this video is coming out uh, today. Later today, it's, it's like... 2:45 in the morning right now but um i don't know when this video is coming out if it's coming out wednesday coming out on thursday but he's coming back as well i'm probably ranting right now i'm probably going off on tangents but overall the match deadline i like what they did a lot of people don't but let me know in the comments below who you think is one of the trade the cubs the mets let me know down below hit that like and subscribe and come back later for another video and i'll see you on the next one thanks for watching